everyone. Welcome to Nicole's Needle Work. My name is Nicole and this is a podcast about stitching. No knitting to share this week. Uh, today is Sunday, September 17th and it's right around 2.30 p.m. Um, let's see. We have been having a nice lazy Sunday. Uh, last week was a little more hectic. Um, it looked like Hurricane Irma was coming right for us, so I had booked a room in Charlotte and then um, realized it was going t more towards my mom. <laughs> so she started kind of panicking a little and um, my brother's there with her, but uh, she doesn't like storms, any kind of storms, so when it would look like a, like a category four hurricane was coming for her, she just wanted to get out of there. So I tried to get her a flight. I was on the phone with the airline and they had just sold the last ticket and um, they were getting ready to close the airport. So I ended up um, meeting my brother halfway in Jacksonville and brought her home with me. And my brother went back with his wife because she didn't want to leave. So anyway, um, we got like tropical storm force winds, but nothing major, just some branches and limbs and leaves in the yard. Um, and that was about it. And my mom's house was fine. Unfortunately, my dad's, he has a mobile home just north of Naples and it didn't make it. Um, well, I shouldn't say though, I don't know. Nobody has been able to get inside there yet, but the screen and porch is gone. Um, the little bedroom that I used to sleep in, uh, the walls are gone. So I don't know what he's gonna do. My heart just goes out to all the people in South Florida that were affected by this and in the Caribbean. It's just awful. And now I see there's another hurricane, uh, Maria, down there and I don't know what it's going to do. It's taken the same path as Irma, but it could go north, um, could come towards us or North Carolina. So we don't know. It's just something we're going to have to watch. So anyway, um, I had taken Jake to DC at the beginning of September and that was a lot of fun. Um, he doesn't remember flying because I think he was around two the last time he flew. So he had a lot of fun on the airplane. And we got to um, do a tour of DC, a bus tour. It was pretty crowded, but we got to see a lot. Um, it was a lot of fun. Um, I did go to In Stitches, but I, I didn't go as crazy. I just got a couple patterns um, while I was there. And I'll show those in a minute. I do have one finish. And that is Queen of Harvest by With Thy Needle and Thread. And this is 40 Count Legacy by Picture This Plus. And I used all the call for threads, one over two. So I had a lot of fun. I picked this back up and then just kept going on it till it was done. I started it last year around Thanksgiving. So that's one finish. And then let's see. I did get a little stash from 123 Stitch. So I'll just go ahead and show all my stash that I've gotten recently. All right. So, um, like many of you, I have been loving uh, Priscilla and Chelsea on their uh, in their YouTube videos. Um, the, all, everything they do, I just love. I, I'm just so amazed by their creativity and the things they come up with. Um, but one thing I got was this Lantern Lane. To join in on the stitch along with them and that's Little House Needleworks it's a really sweet um, Christmas design 
And another stitch along going on right now is needles and pins, so I got that. I don't think I'm gonna start this right now though. It's really cute though. I'm loving all the, seeing all the progress pics on Facebook. Oh, sorry for the jiggling, cat decided. Ginger, come here, come here Ginger. Come here. Nope, she's just gonna stand there in the way. And I also found this on eBay. And this is Magpie Sampler. It's an old sampler from 1991. And someone posted their picture on uh, Facebook and it was so pretty. So right after that, I put in, um, I saved a search in eBay and it popped up. So I was pretty excited to get this. And then I also got um, Berry Cottage Plum Street Sampler, so I love this one. And Witch's Night Out. So cute. And I got the third Summer Schoolhouse pattern. So I've had a little bit of starditis lately. I started that somewhere. Let me put it up here. It is. So I just have little bottom border completed and an E. <laughs> And this is the 28 count mushroom Lugana, one over one. So I worked on that a little bit yesterday. And I'm using all the call for threads. Week Style Works, Classic Color Works, and General Arts. And then I decided to start October 31st. I'm thinking I probably should have started um, Witch's Night Out instead because it's a more reasonable size to get done by Halloween. But that's okay. So here's my little October 31st start. Not much. And I'm also using the same 40 count Legacy by Picture This Plus. I love this linen so much. That's all I have done on that. And I decided, this was a little while ago, I started Lantern Lane, and it's just a teeny tiny bit done. That's all I, that's all I did. And I'm using um, 40 Count Fawn by Lakeside Linen. And I'm doing the Belle Soie. And I changed a couple colors. Instead of vanilla pudding, I'm using icing because it's a little more white. It's not as cream. And instead of walk the plank, I'm using butterscotch. So I think they look really pretty together. Whoops. And I think they look pretty on this linen. So, um, I also, let me see, oh, and speaking of Priscilla and Chelsea, they inspired me to go buy some Charles Craft Monaco from Michaels. I got this big piece of fabric for about $3.50 using my 40% off coupon, and I coffee and tea dyed it. I used well, I guess it's kind of Vanna's method um, of the basting and baking. Um, but I also, they said they cook it on the stove. So I did that a little bit first. And I used some espresso and some tea. 
So I love how it turned out. Not sure what I'm going to do with it, but it's just kind of fun. Um, and other future projects I'm thinking of. I'm thinking of starting this wordplay, October wordplay by With Thy Needle and Thread. And um, I've been thinking about this one too. I've had this in my stash for a while. And it's called In Season by With Thy Needle and Thread. So those are a couple things. I did work on um, His Eyes on the Sparrow just a little bit. I worked on the center tree um, when I was in DC. And I think that's it. It's just going to be a quick episode. Um, hope you guys have a great week. And I will talk to you later. Bye.